struggling with decisions can range from what to get in McDonald's all the way through to the right investment. Hopefully, throughout this video, I can help you to make better decisions and ultimately to stop going to McDonald's and actually buy McDonald's stock and make money from people that go to McDonald's. Now, don't ask me why I went for McDonald's. No clue. Uh, just an example. But what I'm trying to say is everything that you do has a consequence. Your body weight is the result of your diet and fitness plan over your life. Your bank is the result of your financial choices over your lifetime as well. Everything you do has consequences. A great way to see the consequences in real time without the risk of damaging your health or your financial situation is to play chess. I know a lot of you might be saying, well, chess is boring, I don't know how to play it, all this kind of stuff, but just give it a go try it, um, hear what I have to say throughout this video and see if you're going to be giving it a little bit of a chance and hopefully it can help you to make better decisions in the future. Now a really easy way to see the consequences is to literally play someone that you know is better than you at chess because they will outthink you and they will play, play the game much much better than you and understand moves much better than you. Chances are you'll be thinking on a one turn basis so how can I move this piece here, this turn, that's it. And they'll be thinking three or four pieces ahead of you um, and they will just outplay you every single time. So how can you actually get better at decision making? Play chess every single day. Here's the reason why. You will slowly be able to see improvement over the days, over the weeks, over the months that you're playing chess. Now you can do this in person or you can do it online. In person is a little bit better um, just because it's a little bit more interactive and you can physically see the pieces and you can see the person in front of you thinking about the choices that they're going to make. But essentially over time you're going to see different um, moves occurring before they're actually going to happen and you'll start to think in two, three, four, five, six moves ahead. The masters think around 15 steps ahead. So as you're moving one piece and you're thinking about what the consequences are that you're going to be moving this one piece, they're already 15 moves ahead of you. I know you're probably not going to be able to get to that level because I was master chess level. But, you know, if you can get to five moves ahead, that is really, really good. Um, and you know, you'd be able to see the consequences and decision making improve in multiple aspects. Now, chess is more than just decision making. It helps to develop perspective, improve memory, deepens focus, elevates creativity, boosts planning skills, increases self-awareness, protects against dementia, and also helps ADHD. Now, if you want to find out a little bit more about all the benefits and all that kind of stuff of playing chess, you can do it. I've put a link in the description below where you can go and research into it a little bit more. But, you know, just going through those things, it's a massive, massive thing and it can help you with much more than just your decision making. If you increase, if you're improving your perspective, your memory, your focus, your creativity, your planning, your self-awareness, think about how that is going to affect your financial situation your mental health situation, actual health in terms of your body, your nutrition, and the investments that you're going to see over your lifetime. It's going to be massively improved just by playing chess. Now, I know it's a very, very simple thing. I know that a lot of you probably find it boring, but honestly, if it's going to give you all these benefits, it's, it's something that you can play that is a game at the end of the day, and there's multiple levels to it. You can always get better. And it's something that brings along lots of benefits. If you're wanting to increase your decision making process, play chess. There's also a video that inspired this video from uh, Patrick Bet David on value entertainment about the decision making, planning, um, investments, business, all that kind of stuff. And he's actually wrote a book about this as well, which I think is called Fifth, uh, Think 15 Moves Ahead or uh, plan your next 15 moves, something along those lines. Again, I'll put a screenshot on the um, on the screen, probably around here somewhere. Um, and yeah, you can read that book, you can watch those uh, videos, but essentially it's talking about the same thing of planning your moves ahead. And chess is an amazing way of increasing that skill and enabling you to think moves ahead. And when you're doing that in investments, when you're doing that in trading, anything business, 
it's always going to give you an advantage to be able to see 15 steps ahead of your opponents. So I hope you've enjoyed this. If you have, let me know down in the comments below. And I love seeing the feedback from these videos. If there's anything you want me to improve, let me know down in the comments below as well. Have an amazing day. And remember traders, trade happy.